What's up, everybody? It's your boy Steve from the Watts Corner. And this morning, we're doing Breakfast and Watches Episode 8 using the McDowell Time Tide Water. Oh, yeah, I'm loving this. Big shout out to Bill of McDowell Time for sending this over to the channel. Man, I love this. Reviews coming in December. We're going to be making Pillsbury Grand Cinnamon Rolls. But, Leon. Did you really think that I was going to make cinnamon rolls and not make breakfast meat? You're out of your mind, mate. We are making double smoked turkey bacon from my local Amish market. So this is going to be super cool. So let's go ahead and get this camera flipped around and let's start cooking. All right, everybody. It's early in the morning. It's almost 4.15. You can see I'm rocking the McDowell Tide water. We're going to be using the timing bezel to time these cinnamon rolls. So I already have the cinnamon rolls placed on a uh, tray, just waiting for the oven to go off. So we'll go ahead and move the camera to over here. Well, I'm going to be starting my lovely turkey bacon that I already have here in the pan. And I mean, I like to switch it up with turkey bacon because it's not as much... Uh, you know, it's not grease and stuff, but it's better for you. And it is good. The Amish market type is very good. So we're going to go ahead and start heating, cooking the, the turkey bacon. So go ahead and have that on. Yeah, like I said, it's super early in the morning. And I do have my Mandalorian mug with my coffee. And today's my break from walking five miles i normally take sunday off from it i think we're supposed to get rain too today so we're just gonna go ahead and <clears throat> heat the cook this turkey bacon and uh the cats are about you might see one in the video well actually we'll go ahead and see bradley there in the window and then there's charlie laying on the ground there so yeah you know i gotta get my cats in my my cooking videos you know they are my boys and i have to get them in so we're just waiting for the oven to go off. I hope everybody has a fantastic Sunday. <clears throat> just made it easier putting the bacon in here and getting the cinnamon rolls in there. Yeah, it won't be a super long video, but I figure while I'm cooking the bacon, I'm gonna talk. So that'll be good. And we'll go ahead and uh, use this beautiful, beautiful tide water. I will link uh, the pinned comment to Bill's website in the description i love this on this engineer type bracelet it's very very awesome watch and i love this <clears throat> sunburst blue i guess and this blue ceramic bezel insert i mean it's amazing i love this watch very very cool so yeah look at this big uh turkey bacon here man this stuff's insane probably not even gonna eat all this stuff i have some bacon for during a week it's a lot it's a, it's a little bit over a pound but it's nice and thick. It's not like that turkey bacon you get in the store, paper thin. Nah, this is nice and thick. That's why I like to get the Amish market stuff because it's nice and thick bacon. It's not that uh, that little paper thin stuff, you know what I mean? So yeah, we're just letting this cook and I love this pan because you can fit a whole pound in. I jam it in. I like to do it all at once. And yeah, these are the mini grand cinnamon rolls, but it's a four pack. You can get the Sam's Club. So I saw them there. I'm like, I'm going to get them because we like to get eat these Thanksgiving Day, Christmas, and usually New Year's. But if you wait to the end of the year, especially with everything going on COVID, people buy all this stuff out. So when I saw they had them at the wholesale club, because we mainly do our shopping at the wholesale club, I said, oh yeah, I'm going to get this four pack and we'll make them. So that's what we're doing. I, like, I, I even love the smell of turkey bacon cooking in the morning. You know I love regular pork bacon. I'm a pork fanatic, but I wanted to switch it up. I almost got the turkey maple bacon, but I said, nah, let me get this double smoked turkey bacon because we haven't tried this yet. I have to look next time and see if they have maybe pepper turkey bacon. That would be super dope. So, all right, we're almost 30 more degrees. <clears throat> Oven's preheated to 320. Now, the thing with the cinnamon rolls are you can't do what the pack says. My wife reminded me because I'm not the best baker. I only bake them for eight minutes. 
Because if you do what the packet says, I think it says like 15 minutes or something, they'll be hard like hockey pucks. You can't do that. So we'll check them definitely after eight minutes. Timing it on the McDowell Tidewater. Love this watch. Big shout out to Bill, man. Got an amazing watch. I love his watches. I'm hoping I can get the other two in for a review next. But yeah, I love this watch. This is so awesome. I can't stop staring at it. Nope, definitely can't stop staring at it. They're awesome watches. <clears throat> eh, nothing like the smell and the look of bacon in the morning, I'll tell you. All right, well. Actually, I think it's, is it 350 or 375? Let me look at the pack. I think it's 350. Eh. Nope, yeah, it's 375 for these cinnamon rolls. Okay, not 350. My bad. Yeah, not much grease with turkey bacon. Not really greasy meat. It's more of anything, a little bit of water in the turkey. There we go. So with these. We want to give it eight minutes is all we want to do it. So there we go. We'll go ahead and get these cinnamon rolls put in <clears throat> and we'll check them in a little bit. So we'll come back in a little bit uh, with this. Like I said, this is going to be a short episode today. But I figured, what the heck, got to make breakfast on Sunday, so we might as well make it. Why not, right? So I think for the rest of this, I'm just going to go ahead and time lapse the bacon. And then we'll pick up afterwards and have some final thoughts. And I hope everybody enjoys this episode. I really enjoy making these cooking ones. Even though this is a short one, I still will enjoy making this. Alright, what was I thinking? We can't really time lapse the bacon because... We uh, only have eight minutes on the cinnamon rolls, as you can see from my uh, tide water. So yeah, we'll just go ahead and talk while we're making it. So we um trying to grow the channel. We're on the road to 300, and I'm excited about that. Lots of content coming up. I'm taping in the end of December now. Uh, I have one more to tape this coming week which will be for the end of December, and that's going to be for the Fraser and Company Paragon watch. So, yeah, we're, uh, I mean, doing good. I mean, you figure we're in October now, and I already got three months of uh, pretty much almost of content already scheduled to come out, which is good. But, <clears throat> you know something, I hope everybody, if you haven't, please go over and watch the Casio History slash Casio Tron video of my 1976 Casio Tron. I give a brief history of Casio because I'm starting to try to get back to my roots. I mean, I've been getting sucked in the rabbit hole with the micro brands, but there's nothing wrong with that. But I'm trying to do my collection because people know me for my vintage collection slash antique collection. So I want to start throwing one of those videos in at least once, maybe twice a month. You know, to throw them in because that's what people want to see, my collection. So I'm going to start doing those. I like to show off some of my knowledge of my watches and things, you know, and I think people will really like that. So I will start doing that. Oh yeah, this is going to be good. All you do with this turkey breaking is get it brown on both sides. That's all you got to do. It doesn't, it just gets brown on both sides. It's not like the regular bacon. And I like it too because this stuff don't shrivel. Let me get down a plate for this <clears throat> while we're cooking. And I also do want to mention a link to Average Joe Watts Reviews. Link in his bio to his giveaway. He's giving away a... Um, He's giving away a um, Fraser and Company Paragon, so make sure you check that out. And also today, don't forget, his video on deceptions and lies on YouTubers is coming out today. I can't wait. Uh, I know it's probably premiering at 4.30, 
I'm going to be watching the football game, the Ravens game. I'll be coming back from dinner for my mom's when I present my cousin Bob with our grandfather's 1950 fully restored by my watchmaker Tony's Bulaba Diamond Ruby Dowl. So I'm not going to be able to watch his video probably till tonight. But I'm looking forward to that. <clears throat> I love AJ's channel. He's an honest, amazing watch reviewer. Who calls it right down the middle like you should. Not everybody does that. And that's the problem with YouTube reviewers. Is there's a lot of good ones. A lot, I'm not saying there's not. And a lot of honest ones. But then you also got those shady ones. So, you know. That's what I like about him. He calls it how it is, you know. Y'all know I call him my brother from another mother, man. I love that man. Awesome guy. Yeah, I crammed so much bacon in this pan. Hard to move it around, but it's getting done. Yep, it's getting done. And it's almost time, as you can see on the bezel, to check on these cinnamon rolls. I'm still going to hit the light on. Check them out. Yeah, they're almost done. Yep. They are definitely almost done. Still gotta let this bacon go a while because I jammed the whole pound, a little bit over a pound in here. Yep. Got about another minute. Oh, well, it looks like it's right there, so we'll go ahead and pull these out. Check them real quick. Get the little poke for them. Oh yeah, I'm gonna give them a little bit longer, not too, too longer. Mm, give another two minutes, another two minutes, two, three minutes. Then we'll pull them out. You don't want them hard. You don't want them too doughy. We like them right in between. Like I said, you can't always follow the bacon instructions on stuff because you'll burn you'll burn stuff or make it hard as a rock. You just can't. You definitely can't. There we go. Now we're getting some nice brown to this turkey bacon the way we want it. I'm going to lay down some paper towels on my pan here, my plate here to put it on. Yeah, I appreciate every single one of you with the channel. I mean, it's hard work, you know, and I'm the kind of person, you can kick me when I'm down, I'll get back up, you know, I'm not discouraged or nothing. Things will happen, you know. You just got to put the hard work in. It's like anything in life. You got to work hard for your goals and what you want. And I don't have a problem with that, you know. So I'm all about that. And, uh, you know, this is fun. At the end of the day, this is my hobby. I'm not getting paid to do this, you know. This is my hobby. I love horology. I love watches. So this is my hobby. And it has to stay fun. Because if it doesn't stay fun, I wouldn't want to do it. And it is fun. I love watches. It's my, you know, it's, it's a part of my life. So I'm going to continue to plug away and do what I do. Just stay in my lane, focus on my channel, you know. That's all you can do. So I'm definitely going to continue to do that. All right, and we got one more minute, and I'm going to pull these out. One more minute, guys. All right. Actually, it's more like 30 seconds, and we'll pull them out. <clears throat> And then we'll put the cinnamon, we'll put the icing on, guys. Yep. Let me get a spoon out here. All right, all right, y'all, we're done. Turn the oven off. And we are done. Let's pull this over to here. Oh yeah, look at them. Put this icing on them. 
And we are good. You gotta put the ice in the long water. Well, they are, uh, so warm. Eventually melt on their own. All. Alrighty. Seems like they need to give you more icing though. Really does. Sink this little container, and then we got all these done. Look, it just drips down the side and melts on them all while it's hot, trying to spread it out a little bit evenly on them. Well, that one seemed like it got gypped a little bit. Alrighty, yeah, that one got gypped. I'm trying to get some of this runoff nice and on this one here and bam that's it voila we got the cinnamon rolls and go back here to the bacon all the kitties are just laying down on the ground <clears throat> there put some of this all right some of this bacon is getting done so i'm just moving it over Now it's got more room in the pan. We're getting there. All right. Yummy. Get this out of the way early in the morning. I'll make myself another coffee. Now we got some more room for the bacon. We are good to go. Almost done, folks. Almost done. Yep, nothing like the smell of bacon. Yummy, yummy, yummy. So, I hope everybody enjoys this. And please, in the comments, let me know what you want me to make next. If you let me know what you want me to make next, I promise I'll make it. It don't have to be breakfast, it could be a food, I mean a, a dinner item. Just let me know what you'd like to see me make and I will make it, I promise. Um, I've had a couple people comment. French toast, grilled burgers, homemade. Let me know what you want to see me make and I promise I'll make it. Y'all know me, I will. Just uh, leave a comment on what you'd like to see and we will do it. Definitely. We will definitely make whatever you all want to make. Maybe I could even get my wife in one of these videos helping me uh, prep some of this stuff or something. I don't know though. It just depends if she don't if she wants to be on camera or not, you know. So because she's more shy, so we'll see what happens. Yeah, sorry, sorry, Ted. This isn't uh, pork bacon. I know, I know. Don't, don't, don't rail me too much in the comments section, all right, bud. I know this is not uh, pork bacon, buddy, and everybody prefers that. But sometimes you got to go for a little bit more healthier, and that's what I was going for. Plus, it's delicious. I'm telling you, Ted. This turkey bacon, this slab turkey bacon, is amazing. It really is. And this is almost done, guys. <clears throat> we got a couple more pieces left and we're done. And then we'll show the finished plated products of everything. And we will be done. So, yeah, it's almost done here. I'm going to rinse out this cinnamon roll container real quick while we're 
still doing this, y'all. Uh, I love this, the crackling of bacon. It don't matter if it's turkey or pork bacon. There's nothing like that. Nothing like that, y'all. I need another coffee here. Uh, I'm running out. It's about 4.36 in the morning. All right. Plating up the last of this bacon here. Give that one one more flip. That one's done. Okay. And we are good. I will go ahead and move the bacon over here and we'll show you a final shot and then we'll wrap this up. All right. So here we go, folks. You have the bacon and the lovely cinnamon rolls. Now, if you like this type of content, please give me the thumbs up. Hit that bell notification so you know when I'm uploading. Comment, subscribe, and I appreciate every single one of you. <clears throat> Look at that beautiful McDowell timepieces, Tide Water. So please remember, folks, time is short. Let someone you care about know how much you love them today and have a fantastic Sunday IG family. Thanks so much for tuning in.